Welcome back after Labor Day weekend. You ate plenty of chicken, you ate plenty of hot dogs, and you ate lots of barbecue. But we're back with the Daily Dose. And no, it's not a dose of potato salad. It is your favorite podcast from KZWA of trending topics, clickable moments, and pop culture stories with Latone Hart. And TC. TC, fresh off the road from New Orleans and didn't bring nobody any beignets. No, but I got some potato salad galore. What the (laughs) hell is that? Galore is like a lot. But potato salad is potato salad. So, so potato that, salad. Y'all don't galoo. say just here's a lot of potato salad. We say potato salad galoo. Who wants a potato salad galoo? Girl, you got the potato salad galoo? That's how we be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let me, let me uh, get rid of my accent nah. for uh, right now. I just got back. From Every time New you Orleans. go to New Orleans, you come back very New Orleans. I accent. know. So that's why I'm going to speak fully really proper this podcast. No. How y'all doing? <laughs> Today is Pink's birthday. Yay, we love Pink. You know what? I actually do p- love Pink. Pink Pink is one of the most talented artists to come out in the last 15 to 18 years who really doesn't get enough respect. I don't know if you remember Pink's first album. She was signed by Babyface and LaFace Records, and she was a complete R&B artist. Yeah. (laughs) And then she went into like her alternate thing and her rock thing. She has such a beautiful voice. She is talented. She can sing, and she's just so unafraid. She's fearless. I love Pink, man. I pay to see Pink. How old is Pink? She's 36. Her name is Alicia Moore. Is it? That's her real name. I watched a documentary on her like a few years ago. She's from Philadelphia. She's an Eagles fan, so that's how I know. Oh, gosh. She's from Philly. No. Philly. Between you and my dad, I don't know who works. Yeah. Fly, Eagles, fly on the road to victory. Anyways, Kylie Jenner says age is just a number. (laughs) It is. And you'll get a number of years if you keep banging people under a certain number. Exactly. She wishes she could be young forever, and she said her lifestyle is forcing her to grow up. She wishes she could be young forever? Yeah. She said she wishes she was 17. Who wouldn't love to be irresponsible and have mom take care of everything forever? Yeah, but she she makes a lot of money. She bought like a $17.4 million house. Ain't nothing better than being irresponsible and knowing somebody else will take care of the problem. Money or not. Yeah. But... I don't know. I, I'd love to some know. Some people like to be independent and don't like people to take I, care of them. I'd like to be independent and know someone else is going to pay my bills. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love that. That'd be fun. So you don't believe age is just a number? I mean, age is a number. It's a unit, a number of measuring years. No, I mean, age doesn't matter. Oh, age matters a lot. Okay. Age matters a lot. I, I, think I can't so. date anybody that can't name like five members of New Edition. Oh, God. Because we, we don't have anything in common. What are we going to talk about? Uh. <laughs> what are we going to talk about? I already had this conversation with you. <laughs> you Count me out. Uh, what are we going to talk about? You, y'all can talk about a lot of stuff. No. Nah, we, we can't. We, ain't, we don't connect. We got to connect. Outside because of, what does New Edition have to do with you connecting with somebody? To me, that's a cultural thing, man. You know, we 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 in the same mindset. We in the same frame. Oh, yeah, because you don't even know what the flex is. Yeah, you don't even, you don't even listen to the Tony Kwan. You could never date somebody you know my what? age. They'll you know be what? like, hit the flex, Latone. Not listening to Rich Homie Kwan is like, n- well, listening to Rich Homie Kwan is like not reading, and I'm 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 outside of that demo. No. Ugh. Yeah, if Where? you don't read, you listen to Rich Homie Kwan. No. All the time. No, You're some like, people just like rich homie Kwan. Yeah, yeah, some people like drugs. <laughs> What's wrong with you? For I real? don't do drugs. <laughs> <laughs> That's a really good song, though. Like, when they come on in the club, you be like, yeah. You know, there's a whole bunch of really stupid songs that I thought was good when I was your age, too. Whatever. Yeah, there is. It's, I didn't mean, bunch. like, lyric-wise. I meant, this like, it's good. It feels just, good. It makes yeah, you vibe. Yeah, you want to get you crunk, get you turned oh, up in the A whole bunch club. of songs I could think like that. Uh, they Want Effects by Das Effects. Stupidest song in the world. Loved it. But it used to get y'all hype. Still does. Still do. I never heard it. You have to let me listen to it. You never heard They Want Effects? Sing it. Bum, skibbity, bum, skibbity, boom, hop. That, exactly. See how you looked at me? We makes could, no sense. We couldn't date. <laughs> too, makes too no many years sense. Between us. <laughs> makes no sense. But yeah, it was a great song. Wait, how does it go for real? I don't, I'm going to play it for you in a moment. You're going to be like, you. what in the world? Because it makes no It's gibberish, but it's a great song. But it's hype. Exactly. It's That's just, all it's about. It's just in the moment. So there's a new blood test that tells when you're going to die. Oh, 
I won't be taking it. Why? You I just want to know? I don't want to know when I'm going to die. I just want to be walking down the street with like a popsicle in my hand and just fall out and be dead. I don't even want, I don't, I don't want to know. I just want to get hit by a car and be out of here. I, I think I would kind of want to know. But Why? Then, well, because I like to know. No. Like, I just, I'm so nosy and I curious. do not want to know that. Yeah, but then I feel like it'll kind of mess my head up. Like, I'll just be like, man, it's going to happen on September 3rd. This day, oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? What? And I'm gonna start trying to plan my life out, and then I'm gonna start walking around like I don't know. There are a lot crazy. of variables to a blood test. that's gonna tell you when you die. This is meaning if you never have any accidents or you never, you know, get shot. Yeah, or this you... is just an aging signature. Oh, tool. so basically, if you live a boring life, you sit in the house all day. This is when you'll die. So it would work for me because I sit in the house all no, day. <laughs> see, I want to die like jumping off a mountain. I want to do something exciting. I want to go out with a bang. Really? Yes. I do not want to die old, alone, quietly Not in the alone. House. You'll have your cats with you. Well, I, I don't want to die boring. That's not boring. Some people think that's a good time. I think laying down in the bed watching Prison Break is like the most fun that I can have in my life. Look, everything about my life, I want it to be like a moment where somebody's like, man, do you remember Laton? But th- that, he's a fool. I want to die that way, too. Like, you remember how like, he ate 25 bowls of spaghetti and he said he wasn't going to stop and he just fell out? He blew up and sauce flew on everybody yeah. and then noodles was exactly, flying. Exactly. <laughs> no, I'm good. I want to leave with a bang. Anyways, there is a Sugar Baby of the Year contest. Oh, that's that's all you. I'm trying to get on there, y'all. What's the website? What is it? That, that is all you. <laughs> the website. What if they don't know what a sugar baby is? Do you know what a sugar baby is? <laughs> Tell them what a sugar baby is. A sugar baby is someone who has a sugar daddy. And a yeah. sugar daddy is the man with the sugar. <laughs> sugar daddy is somebody like me with a bunch of change in his pocket. No, not any coins. We're talking paper, not <laughs> coins. We don't want anybody with their dangling coins that we're collecting. Pennies. Wait a minute. Let, let me let me defend coins. Say your house catches on fire. All those dollars get burnt up. Coins can't get burnt up. That's right. Well, then you're going to be rich. Because exactly. guess what? You got all the coins. That's right. I got pennies <laughs> all over. You know what? You're not going to get a sugar baby like that. you crazy. They're going to say, what am I going to do with these pennies? I'll take an equal baby. Whatever I can get. An equal baby? Yeah. <laughs> what is that? Neutral sweet baby? Wherever they at? No, man. A <laughs> sweet and low baby? <laughs> <laughs> I'll take whatever type of baby I can get. No. I want to I wanna sign up on sugar babies so I could, uh, on the website, so I can give me a sugar daddy and pay my debt. My student <laughs> debt. I'm $24,000 in debt. <laughs> you know what? There's some old rich guy that will take you up on that. <laughs> He will. He's probably looking right now. Oh, yeah, T.C. T.C. Once I put my dentures in, I'm Let coming. Let me go sign up right now, mister. Hold on, man. I'm just kidding. Over 10,000 women have entered the contest, so they're trying to narrow down to 12 women to make a calendar. Oh, so you get a, do you get money, though? No, you're just going to be featured in a calendar. Oh, but I guess then you, you get all like the real top, sugar. But you're going to be the top sugar baby, so then all the sugar dads going to be like, man, that's the top sugar baby. I'm trying to get <laughs> yeah, her. The, What's she doing to be the top sugar yeah, baby? This can't yeah. be life. We have top sugar babies in the world. <laughs> Not just a sugar baby, the top sugar baby. You know what? Why are you hating on sugar babies? I'm not. You know if you was a female, you'd be right on that website. <laughs> going, hold up, wait, what is this? Uh-uh. I'd be a sugar toddler. I ain't going to be no a sugar, sugar t- <laughs> <laughs> So, I have my girl trivia for you. Oh, here it is. The worst part of the day. The w- <laughs> On what piece of women's clothing would you be likely to find an underwire? Oh, I know this. i dated lots of women with corsets on. <laughs> That's the bra. Yeah, a bra. I've taken many off in my day. You know what? And I feel like that's the only reason why you know that. I'm surprised <laughs> your uh your women don't have the wireless ones, the ones yeah. with that like with the net and <laughs> no I, cup, no cup for support. As a child, I studied many a JCP, JC Penny catalog and look at the all the bras and. I believe you. Uh, you should. I'm telling the truth. I bet you can like take a bra off with like one hand and just like flick it open. I used to, but now. You know, I deal with a lot of women that just go braless and let them hang. So, you know. All on a waist, just That's like right. dangling. Let, let gravity, do let your gravity work. Do hang low? Do they wobble to the floor? Ooh, you're turning me on. Let's get to the next subject. I can't stand you. That's all we got for today. <laughs> Thank y'all for listening. Go follow us on Facebook at KZWA and on Instagram and Twitter at KZWA1049. And we are on the worldwide interwebs at www.kzwafm.com. <laughs> and we're on Black Planet and AOL. 
<laughs> we're really not. <laughs> Wait, don't look us up on AOL. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Lagrange. They're the team of the week this week, and we're going to be at their game this Ooh, Friday. Go Gators. Night. They're going to destroy Sam Houston. I Ooh. can't wait. It's the Daily Dose with Latone Hart. And TC. That's it.